Behind the nostril, deep in the lining of the nose, lives a bundle of nerves called the sphenopalatine ganglion. This ganglion coordinates pain to the surface of the brain, as well as coordinate pain behind the eyeballs and into the temples. It also regulates blood vessel dilation and constriction to the surface of the brain and into the face. Putting numbing medicine onto this nerve bundle area reduces pain in those regions, as well as can improve overall chronic headache syndromes and facial pain syndromes. When we do a sphenocath procedure, we're going to have you laying flat on an exam table with your chin tilted up. We're going to put the catheter in your nostril and advance it to the top of your nose. Most patients feel some pressure and a bit of a pinch when it goes to the right spot. Once we have it where we need it to be, we're going to put a quarter teaspoon of numbing medicine to the back of your nasal cavity. Now this is going to taste bitter and nasty and it's going to make your throat feel numb and tingly. Now, even though you can breathe normal and swallow normal throughout the entire procedure, it's going to feel a bit different when you swallow because of that numbness sensation. We're going to have you stay in that position for five minutes. During that time, you might feel your cheek warmth increase, and you might also notice some tearing out of the corner of your eye. Those are all normal signs the medicine is doing what it's supposed to do. After five minutes of laying in this position, we sit you up, and away you go.